20 months ago on Sunday, August 20th, 2017, Tanner was taken away from me at a young age of 19. Since his murder, my family and I have been struggling to accept the fact that we can never see Tanner's beautiful smile again. He had a smile that could brighten anyone's day. Tanner had a big heart and would help anyone at any time. He worked hard as a directional driller and was a dedicated student with a passion for fitness and at leading a healthy lifestyle. Never in a million years would I have thought my son would have been a victim of murder. Few can understand my grief and no one should ever, ever endure the same heartache that I have experienced. Had he been alive, Tanner would be 21 years old, finishing his studies in fitness and making a positive impact in the lives of every person he met. Tanner was my only son and life will never be the same without him. Tanner deserves justice. If you have any information about Tanner's death, no matter how small or insignificant you think it is, I'm pleading with you, please, with you as a mother who has lost her only precious son, to please come forward. Please contact IHIT or Crime Stoppers if you wish to remain anonymous. Any piece of information is so important. So our investigators uh, have been diligently investigating Tanner's case from the beginning, back on August 20th. And recent information has risen that there are people that have intimate knowledge about what happened to Tanner uh, that have now moved to Edmonton. So it's very critical that we speak to them and those individuals know who they are. Uh, please reach out to us. Uh, it's been uh, you know, almost two years since uh, Tanner's passing. It's about time that we get some information that can really uh, lead to a breakthrough in his case. And Kim and Tanner's friends and family are eagerly, eagerly awaiting those answers. So we're working hard for them. Uh, so please, today, do the right thing.